So I heard that you almost actually missed this premiere because you're flying out tomorrow to start a new movie. Exactly, man. Yeah, I'm excited to be here, though. I'm glad I made it. Sure. So how many days, you were playing a trumpet player in this film, correct? Yeah, I was, Greg the Trumpeter. <laughs> Have you played trumpet before did, this I film? I played trumpet when I was young. I was in middle school. It's not, it's not anything that I'm great at. And luckily I had to suck in the film, so it worked out. <laughs> and so did you get to meet a lot of the cast in this film? How, how many days did you work on the film? I didn't work long. It was only a 19-day film. So, I mean, they, they shot it really, really quickly. But I worked with Miles, I worked with JK, and obviously Damien. And it was an amazing experience. They're all seasoned actors doing amazing things. So just to be, you know, working with them in that environment, it was, it was, it was amazing. Once in a lifetime type stuff. Well, have you got a chance to see the film yet? I have. So. I have. There was a screening at Sony a, a week ago, and I was blown away. Everybody's been talking about it. And I'm like, thanks, man. I haven't seen it yet. Cool. Because it was like in Toronto and New York. But finally I saw it, and it was intense, man. It what was about it do you think that audiences are connecting so much with? Just the characters, that's the thing about it. It's just like you you really, as crazy as JK is in the film, you get where he's going with it. You understand how hard he's trying to push these kids. But then you understand these kids who just want this dream and they're trying to please him. And kind of like, it's like just this weird, yeah, it's just that weird just balance it going back and forth and you just don't know. You don't know where it's leading. And, and once you find out, you're like, wow. Whiplash is the best film I've ever seen. The best. The best I've ever the seen. <laughs> All right, well, you're also on Awkward, which is hugely popular right now. Uh, can you tell me a little bit about that? It's such a good time. It's a first for me being on such an awesome show with like an amazing fan base like that. Tyler and Lissa and everybody are part of the PHHS crew. They're having a good time. We have like six more episodes of the season and all kinds of crazy stuff coming. So I'm excited for you guys to see. Well, I like that you have a little bit of like flower in the attic-esque oh stuff going God, on. God, he pulled out a reference. <laughs> um, yeah, that's interesting. That's interesting. And it's cool because Greer is amazing. So it's not like awkward. It seems awkward. No pun intended. Right, no pun intended. But it's actually really dope. Yeah. You're leaving tomorrow to film a movie called Kicks, correct? Kicks, man. I'm excited about that. Yeah, I'm playing a role called Flacco, and Flacco is just like, he's a different type, type of dude. He's from Oakland, California. He doesn't come to premieres or anything like that. So, yeah, it's going to be wild. Different for me, but I'm excited to take it on, for sure. Looking forward to it. Congratulations. Have a good night. Thanks for talking to me. Yeah, for sure. Cheers.